declared a birthplace of the Civil War. Tonight, people in one historic city in Kansas are worried one popular part of their city could become just that, history. Jenna Hanchard tells us how the U.S. Postal Service could play a role. Right now, we're fighting to at least keep what we have, but we're really fighting not to lose it. The identity of Lecompton, Kansas, is partially housed in the last standing post office in this small city of 500. It's amazing how many people meet here every morning. It's kind of the collection point. In 2012, the Lecompton Post Office was one of 13,000 post offices across the nation where hours were cut to save money. Right now, we're open four hours per day during the week, and we're open an hour and a half on Saturday mornings. Folks at work. Uh, it makes it real tough for them to try to get here, you know, in time before it closes up. I gotta either make a special trip here or wait till Saturday morning to buy stamps, so I try to buy my stamps on Saturday. The fears of city officials are mounting now that the post office lease is up this year. A bigger concern is further reduction of service and the potential of losing the post office. A spokesperson for the U.S. Postal Service says there are no plans to close this post office, but city leaders fear the identity of a historic Historic city is on the chopping block. In Lecompton, Kansas, Jenna Hanchard, 41 Action News.